So just a quick update video uh, about the EGR valve I bought for the Nissan Note. It's a 62 plate. I got the EGR valve from Autodoc online website. Um, I think it costs around about 140 to 50 quid. So here it is. Uh, on the Autodoc website there's a choice. Uh, I inputted the car details but it did give a choice of uh, EGR valve types. So it was types with the coolant pipes in and out or without. So without the coolant pipes would have been, been the wrong, wrong one. So uh, just if you're buying, make sure you buy the correct EGR for the car. And for this particular 1.5 DCI, it's one with the coolant pipes. So I've taken the black plastic cover off. Five pin socket inside there. This is a positional switch. which acts on this part here, which is on top of the valve. So depending on which position the valve's in, the switch then informs the ECR whether it's open or closed. This part here is a motor. And the motor drives this crank round to drive the valve opened or closed. So I'm just going to do a test of this new EGR valve. I've got a 9 volt battery, PP9 battery, and I've connected into the uh, socket and pins 2 and 5. And that's simply what happens. The, uh, the motor spins, turns the crank and drives the, the valve open and closed. So that's correct operation, just using a little 9 volt battery. So the fault with my, my old EGR was the motor was just simply spinning, not mechanically connected to the crank and the valve didn't open.